I'm not getting any sound here. What is going on here? Gotta change the battery. You wore us out. Battery? Battery? What did you oh, come oh, at this crap? Oh, You're a terrible actor, like a terrible comic. Now you're gonna be a terrible cameraman. It's a plan. You wanna do this show? Hey, I waited till you fixed the battery, till you fixed the lens. Now you're busting my bananas. Are you a director? This thing called action. Action. The joke sucks. You suck for having the idea of putting this on a documentary. It's asinine. It's a disgrace to the American culture. Do something constructive. People are dying. There's more important things in life than telling stupid jokes. Go to Africa and find out what a tsetse fly is. And is, is. I don't like jokes. I don't tell jokes. I can't stand when somebody comes over and says, did you hear the one about, did you hear the one about? Hear about the two penguins or two ducks? I don't care. Then you got the assholes who got riddles. What's round is an apple shaped like a pear, split in the middle, surrounded by hair. I said, a vagina. The guy's now, it's an eye. Who cares that it's an eye? Who cares? Why bother me, you stupid bastard? This is what you served me. I'm getting no money for this shit. You served me water. At this point in my career, working with Robert De Niro and the biggest stars in the business, that I gotta wind up on Mulberry Street with a guy called Paul Provenza, who's a friend of mine, who done a lot of things in show business, and it's over. And he wants me to share his overness. How come you're not in show business anymore? You are northern exposure, and this is where you wind up? Where do you find out this guy flew in from the coast, from California to do this fucking thing? Christ almighty, Paul. Where's this gonna be shown? To blind people? Do me a favor. Don't even mention I'm on this thing. And make sure Penn and Teller is not on this goddamn thing. You got too many props. I don't like guys with props. I'm one guy, no props, that's it. Go out there, make the people laugh. That's why I'm a genius of myself. See, he needs two. Penn and Teller needs two. I don't need, it's all me. If I cried out loud, what do you go to work this week? You're gonna say, you know, we're not that talented. <laughs> I go into my kind of comedy, which is telling stories, which is bringing out the brilliance, the nectar of greatness. That's what you do. Action. They go to an agent's office. The father says to the agent, I got a great act here. We're known as the Denapolis. Well, not sure it's gonna be Jewish. Gotta be Italian. I gotta keep my people working too. These are my two children. They're geniuses. They pass gas to the tune of what a wonderful world in unison. It's spellbounding, spellbounding. I blow my nose without a handkerchief. Anyone that picks up three boogies wins a turkey. Give them a prize. Always a prize gets the audience. My wife, she has one leg, does a ballet on a high wire act with the wooden leg. Now the coup de grace, the coup de grace, in case you come from France. My grandmother on the stage has an abortion, gives birth to a three pound Shetland pony. My grandfather is the jockey, comes in third and paid 280. You wanna know what? What's the name of the act? Come on, the aristocrats. I'm embarrassed to tell that joke. It's probably, in my opinion, and I am very opinionated, the worst joke that was ever written. Couldn't you pick out another joke, something that has depth? A joke about Jacques Cousteau, that's depth. And action. I'm not gonna tell the joke again. Once I told the joke my way, that's it. It was hilarious. I stole the show again. I always steal the show. I'm a genius. I'm a fucking genius. You don't repeat greatness. Tell the joke again. Why? The first one wasn't enough. It was so good. No, to... you, if it's good, why were you gonna go for two goods? You're allowed one good a day with me. Just in case the tape screws that, up. I, don't, I hope it does. If it screws up, I'm out of the picture here. What am I talking to you for? Action. Are you nuts? You told me only two, three minutes over here. What do you want? What do you want for nothing? You want me to keep talking because you need time. You say, get Cooper, he'll talk until the cows come home. I hate to tell you, moo. That's it, Paul. Paul, that's it. A fungu. All right, that's it, Paul. It's over. Go home already. You're still rolling. Oh, God almighty. You people who watch this shit are stupider than I am doing this. You pay for this shit, I want a piece of this. Stop already. What is this fucking guy? I'm a genius, I told you, it's over. I don't give too many of my geniuses away. <laughs> I'm finished. What is it? He does this all the time. Yeah, but what? what, what he what thinks do you... the genius comes after. Can I tell you something? You're right.